Um, hello everyone, and welcome to my channel. So, uh, I recently finished the sketchbook, and it's really big. Um, and I thought I would, like, go through and show you some of these pages, because I moved on to a different sketchbook, and this one is done, and I, uh, so, if you're new to my channel, welcome, hello. But if you've already been here, you've probably seen that I've only, like, uploaded animations, but I do a lot of traditional art and pages and like books and stuff so I want to share some of that so the sketchbook I got from Michaels I'm not sure what exactly it was but I think it was a journal not a sketchbook and I just use it as a sketchbook um I worked on this for a few months I'm not sure how many exactly but I started it in 2023 but we'll start flipping through this so yeah, I started 2023. This page, um, it, I did watercolor and then I just like, it's kind of dirty. I don't, I don't know what happened to it, but this was like, also this sketchbook, I like started it and I skipped a bunch of pages and then I like quit and came back. So it has a lot of older art because my art changes a lot throughout time. So I just have a little cat. I don't know. Some of these are, it's like, upside down otter this page is also done um it's i used watercolor and posca markers and it's just a silly little cat um right here it's a um, uh like a bunch of different things so i've got like magazines in the background and then i used blank paper and i just used a normal pen and i drew that here and over here i used a newspaper i have no clue what it's talking about and another uh drawing i have a little rabbit it also got really dirty and a lot of the earlier pages get like um like imprint a lot of it this is a uh, little ferret i did this with acrylic paint that some really like cheap stuff from i don't know walmart or something and i drew these two ferrets and right here i did this with Posca pen and I've got like a little uh, flap that opens up and uh, another po more Posca. I use a lot of Posca. Um, this page has changed a lot. I go back and edit a lot of pages. So over here there was like a person drawn under this and I didn't like how they looked. So, oh yeah, also we're outside so there's gonna be some noise. Um, so I didn't like how it looked and I edited, I put a cat under, and I didn't like how that cat looked, so I changed it. I changed a lot of the pages, and over here, just put a big black grayish piece of paper, and went over with, um, I believe these are colored pencils, white colored pencil, and the cat, this, is drawn with Prisma color. Yeah, so, I, there's some people, but I'm, I'm I mostly draw, uh, uh, animals because that's what I'm more comfortable with so you'll see a few people in here but it's mostly animals and then this is just a newspaper uh, here's another person and a cat I drew cats differently also it's feel really janky and I did this with highlighter and Posca pen but I sketch everything out first so obviously it's a pencil um, over here I was just messing around with Posca markers I've got a random page with some turkeys. This page, it's, I used pens. Oh yeah, sorry, the turkey page is giving me some trouble. Over here, I used pens and I sketched everything out first. I think, like, I don't know, one of these was an erasable pen, so it kind of smudged here. And I just like was messing around. And the same thing here, I sketch everything out first, and then I go back, and I use pens. Over here I did the background first, I'm not very good at people, so, um, his feet are messed up. Also, I'm not really good with shading color pencils, so it's also, and I did the background with just a normal black pen. And so what I was doing here is I was doing like a flipped, so over here I colored the guy and then the background was black and white, but over here the guy is black and white and then the background's colored, but I gave up coloring it halfway through and just stuck a magazine right here. And there's a little cat. Oh, this is another me messing around with Posca markers of just drawing a bunch of random dogs. 
but I got bored of the dog, so I just kind of like drew a really big dog and stuck him on there. Uh, I think this is just some colored pencils. Uh, this page is interesting because it looks like it's a bunch of scribbles, but every single one of those is actually a drawing. And like, if you look closely, oh, I can't really show you that close because my shadow. And um, I stuck some stickers on there, some Hollow Knight stickers, and I don't know, some shoes and a drink. Sorry, I'm having trouble on holding my phone with my other hand. Um, I did this page around Halloween, just a silly little, I colored the background with, um, black acrylic paint, and I just used a white pen and went over. I was trying to draw my room here, uh, proportions I got around. Oh, Pokemon. So, I really like Pokemon, and I, uh, over here, Sylveon's my favorite, so I like Sylveon, but I messed up here. I gave it an extra ribbon for some reason, and Sylveon doesn't have a ribbon there. So it bothers me, but this is with the Pascal markers, and so is this. Pikachu is a little scary, but I'm talking about that. This page, I just used it to test out markers and stuff because I didn't like how the ferret looked like, and I just used it to like scribble to test out markers. Oh, there's one. There's another page I drew Sylveon. It was uh, also around Halloween, and I had one of like the trick or treat packs. So I just used the thing, and I drew Mimikyu and put the right shoe right there. I was trying to draw Tem shop from Undertale, but I couldn't uh, draw Temmie's face, so it's just a sketch. I think I might have posted this on a community post, but I'm not 100% sure. This page I did with pen and Posca markers. This is also Posca, I call them Posca markers, but they're pens. Um, this is also, and I blended this also. And there's also some flowers on here. I like to like collect flowers sometimes and like put them in my sketchbooks. Um, this is also some Posca. I draw a lot of like repeated animals, deer, dogs, cats a lot, um, and st stuff like that, and rabbits. So here's some deer. Um, I did these with as well, also Posca, as I said. Uh, I've got like glitter pens right here and I did I don't like this page this much but I did this with acrylic paint and this is with Posca and I just like taped in a bunch of pictures oh uh this is a bunch of like liminal spaces I love liminal spaces they're I find them really comforting and I enjoy looking at them so I've just printed out a bunch of pictures of liminal spaces I really like this one and this one and I, I have a lot of pages where I just kind of like stick pictures in because I think it's cool. Oh, I got like alcohol markers and I was testing them. Not the best, but I was just messing around. And same thing, I glued in a bunch of pictures of these fish and I just drew a little fish and a cat. Not Nothing much. So I try to do comics sometimes, but they don't turn out good and uh, I'm not very good. So with comics, I usually try to stay away. Um, same thing here. Oh, sorry, my finger. Um, same thing here. It's just a picture taped on. Oh, over here. I really like this page. It's also Posca pens. And I just got a bunch of, like, um, things I guess you could buy at a store or, like, some stores. And I just wrote, like, a little rabbit mega sale. I really like this page a lot because of the colors. I like adding a lot of colors. Um, this page... I also, um, there's a little cat, I just drew, put a bunch of different, like, pictures, this is alcohol markers, also alcohol markers, this is Posca pens, and I just glued on a picture, I don't like the flowers that much, but, but it's an okay page. Over here, I think around this, I started, like, losing some of my inspiration, or I had ideas, I just wasn't executing them that well, because I had a really good idea, because this paper said dealing with deer, and I was like, oh my god, let me make a little thing where two deer, like, deer are making a deal, but I don't, I don't like this, and I don't like the background, so I'd like, I just don't like how I executed it. Um, some pages are incomplete, I, a lot of my pages are, like, inspired by music, and I was gonna do one here, but I gave up. Oh, Del Deltarune. I really like um, a lot of Toby Fox games. I I'm very excited for Chapter 3. I can't wait for that. Chapter 3 and 4. But um, I made these after I played Deltarune. And this was just a random page. I don't know. Uh, I don't like how the deer standing here. But it's, it's a cool concept what I was trying to do here. 
Um, I like to experiment with a bunch of things. This, something, I don't know, it like bled through and I had a drawing that I didn't really like there. I just put a picture. I don't know if it's a kangaroo. I don't know. And I found like these really old drawings I made once. It might, the way I drew cats was really different. I think I drew these in like class or something. Oh, and I just like stuck them in here. Uh, another like song based page. Um, I forgot who made the song, but it's, it's got like a liminal vibe to it. A little capybara. Um, and I thought it was cool. Oh, another song. Uh, this page is blank, but I forget what this song is called. I think it, no, I have no clue. Um, but it's a really good song. Uh, this is the same cat. No, this is a rabbit. Yeah, same things. And here's another flower that I had. I just painted clouds over here with acrylic paint. I did this with alcohol markers. It's supposed to be a bench. I'm not sure if you can tell. And this cat over here, one of my friends accidentally spilled water on, but I still think I really like this page. Oh, these pages are really like, so I did this background with, first I sketched this out and then I uh, traced it with pencil. And then I did the background of this with, um, Posca pen and this cat i love this cat because oh my god i got its eyes to move um i just randomly i was like oh my god let me make like a page where the cat, its eyes can move and i made that and then so how i did it was i got like um i don't know how to explain it if you could tell by just looking thank you um but yeah and then i this cat has been through some things. I don't know. I had to have something th so that you couldn't see what was behind. This is a page of just random things. I drew this little um, cat, and little a alien spaceship, and um, a snake. One of my friends drew this little guy up here. was sticky you note. Know. Um, I drew this also while I was listening to the song. I was trying to put the song on the page, but it wasn't really um, turning out. It I, I did not do a good job of that. It. Oh, this page. So I um. I did the background first, and then I randomly added these guys on here. It's a um a fairy cat, a catfish, a dog thing, and a spring trap. He's kind of random. Um, and then I have a party cat. So um, there's a lot of I use a lot of glitter pens, like the glitter glue, and so you can see it here. Oh my God, it's so hot out here. Um, and, oh, I was trying to draw a maned wolf here, so I, it doesn't look the best, but he's good. And then over here, it just, like, opens up, and I just found, like, this random, um, textbook page that I, um, put in, like, free textbook. I don't know what it was. It was a card, and I liked it, so I drew it. I drew this in art class one day randomly, and I put a magazine behind it, and then the ribbon, because I thought it looked really nice, and... This is another random page where I used um, some paper stickers, a silly bird. I do a lot of pages where it's like, uh, uh, hello. I do a lot of pages where um, I use pen and a watercolor. So over here, I was just messing around with some colors. I never, I was gonna draw manatee here, but I never um, started. Oh, these are just empty pages. There's some of you empty pages. There's another one of those watercolor, but I don't like how I did these two pages, so we're just gonna skip over them. Um, here's another one of these pages. A more glitter. I don't know if you can see it on camera. Like, can you see the glitter shining? And over here is watercolor pen. This is acrylic paint, and this is more acrylic paint, and I just glued it on newspaper. Um, this is, um, alcohol markers, and I believe watercolor and pen for this cat. But I like, I did this with alcohol markers. And I was trying to test out these new paints I found, but um, I was having a lot of trouble with them because you could see through them. And so you can see like the sole of the cat on the page behind it. And also like the paint was like doing this weird uh, sticking thing. So I put like over it, but then I just covered it with Mod Podge so it stopped um, sticking. And this is a rabbit I put like over this page because I don't like the original drawing behind it. Oh, and this is, there was a different drawing under here that I didn't really like that much either. I cover up a lot of, like, I go back and, like, 
um, I did a lot of these pages that I don't like, but this is from just a random sketchbook I found, and this I did on some tag board, I just like, um, I get tired of tape gluing things in sometimes, so it just kind of taped in here, so, this cat, um, over here is just some cats baking some things, drinking, um, I don't know, sleeping, and I found, like, this recipe for icing at a shop, and I, like, taped it in here and put, like, a little, um, planner page, and I just filled it out, and I thought it was cute. Um, some birds. I really like birds. You can hear the birds in the background right here. Um, but yeah, some birds right here, and more watercolor and pen. I use a lot of watercolor. And then this is acrylic paint. This is an empty page, but acrylic paint, some white pen, more acrylic paint and white pen. And this is obviously based on the song um, "Pump It Up, Kitty." Oh, there's a bee. Oh, no. A bee landed on the page. Um, uh, this is, I did this with acrylic paint, um, pencil. You can see the pencil, and then I put some random sticky notes. I think that's white pen. Oh, no, that's a, a acrylic paint. Um, and then I went over with sticky notes and just, like, made this cool thing. Over here, I got, like, these new watercolor paintbrushes. I was trying to test them out. But this took me a lot of time because it was a bunch of, like, small little, um, uh, brush strokes. And this is an unfinished page. I was testing out some of my friend's markers. Over here I've got this, like, oh my god, the wind. This, like, silly little Roblox guy partying. I play a lot of different video games, so you'll see that, like, in here. Um... This was originally like a cat, you can, it's ear, like a piece of its ear was right there, but I didn't like how it is, so I just got like, um, paint and I blended it like down and I got like, uh, white, uh, pens and I just drew cats and put some silly tape over it. Over here I was testing out pencil with watercolor with these two and I just got random holographic, um, tape right here and over here I just taped in a bunch of random drawings. Uh, same thing here, watercolor and pens. This is a blue piece of paper I found, and it's just, like, watercolor. Same, this is also watercolor, and then I, I really like how the word what looks here. And I think, I think this is the only page that's just pencil in the sketchbook, because I add a lot of color. I like color. Um, some, just, I put in random pictures of things, random times. So this is just some birds. This guy's been through some things. I don't know why he looks so traumatized. Um, this is just like, I don't know, a creepy deer. Uh, there's a normal deer, a spring trap, and a suit. I, um, this is a spring trap and Vanny. I had another drawing, but I think I put it in the back of my sketchbook because it kept falling out. Let me find it. Moment, please. Um, oh, there it is. Oh my god. Here. Oh, okay, I got this on piece of random glitter paper in the back of my sketchbook okay and this is another page i think i might have posted this on a community post but i'm not sure and so um this is paint markers like yeah and so it was this i think they're my friends I, they're not posca but this is pencil and i sketched this out pen this is also pencil and pen this is on some like uh, construction paper and it's alcohol marker and so is this but I got some white pen and same thing with this these two are both alcohol marker and some just random stickers I put um okay so these two pages I really really like um this is currently the cat that's my profile picture and this uh I did, so I put like a piece of pink construction paper in the background, drew strawberries, and then I did this on a like tag board construction, I don't know how to, like if you know what tag board is, yeah. Um, and then I got graph paper here and I drew on some tag board and put it up and just decorated it with pens. And the strawberries I drew back here are with um, paint markers. Where I just drew some cats with um, pen and then I went with crayons in the background. Over here, I was testing out some new crayons because they were supposed to be neon, and so I. This is a bunch of neon. And over here is watercolor, so this is one of my friend's brush pens, and this is just a normal old pen, and uh, there's so much going on. I like when there's a lot of going, stuff going on. So, 
some of the pages started to get more empty. I think I was trying to draw an RP here without a reference, and over here too, but it looks a little silly. And just a random cat seal, and over here with these, there's a bee really close to me. I don't want to get stung, but okay. Um, sorry. Uh, I got like these two butterflies and I stuck them on and it looks like there's actually butterflies on there. It's, it's cool. It, it looks um, better in person. Um, yeah. Oh my gosh. Let's try to draw a person. Didn't work out well. I've got this little pretty cat and this is just a um, normal pen. Okay, so this I struggled with because I originally made it on a different piece of paper and I was trying to, it's like a, I don't know what it is. I just wanted to make something that would like pop out of the sketchbook and I didn't know what to do in the background, but I had to do a lot of surgery for it to stay in here. Wait, sorry, let me recenter this. Um, so over here, I started out with the background because I was just messing around with a lot of colors. This is acrylic paint and then I went back with pencil and crayons and filled in all the gaps and then i just drew the silly cat and put it in here yeah so these pages are starting to get empty um this cat was supposed to be like inside a house um this is the background and this was the planning of one of the paintings you saw earlier some hollow night art uh this is just like i don't know what this is it's like clear paper i, just, I did this with watercolor pen some fabric black construction paper and white pens um just like a drawing of a rat or mouse i don't know and these pages i, I really like this page i like the liner look at the silly little guy he's so cute let me turn on my camera um and i was like practicing um, my line art i think it's really pretty and oh bugbo he does not look good though has a bad drawing of bugbo and that is the end. This is the last few pages. I did this with construction paper, just some stickers and a drawing on one of my shoes. And that that is my sketchbook. Um, thank you all for being here. Um, if you watch my videos, I appreciate it a lot, and I appreciate it a lot if you, um, when you subscribe or comment, it makes my day. Um, so thank you and goodbye.